And he was asking what this was, uh, something he'd never seen before. And in this case, you can actually see there is an eruption that happens right here. And what I'm going to show you later is that this whole object here, this spherical, sh spherical object and this long string actually erupt later on. But this particular object is really very common on the sun. This is what's called a co part of what's called a coronal cavity. So filaments, when you see them on the solar disk, in certain wavelengths appear dark because they're cooler material in relation to what's in the background. When you look at them on the edge of the sun, then they're brighter, we call these prominences, but they're the same object. And they sit in this kind of tunnel called the filament channel. So when you look at it from the edge of the sun, what you actually see is this spherical object. You're actually looking down the tunnel, and this tunnel sits up top of the filament. Here is the filament we were talking about looking from the edge with stereo, so looking around the side of the sun. And then when we look back on the disk, you see there's the spherical object, and then there's a larger shell. Okay, this is the whole coronal cavity, and then what he was seeing was part of the top of it. We can look at a video which shows this structure in two different wavelengths, 171 which is the predominant structure that he was seeing. And then there's also 304, which shows the filament. And here we're seeing the whole structure erupt. So what's kind of interesting about this is that when these are quite common when you, before CME eruptions, and seeing it really high up in the corona is also a possible indication that it's about to erupt. So when the CME actually erupts, as we'll see in this video, the whole structure comes out and you can actually see this cavity as it's moving out. So at the very edge, there's the cavity. And then we see the filament itself, okay, the filament material. 